Philip and Sargadama Pottery Production Center. I am working as a potter here from past uh, four years. We are uh, uh, working lots of designing work and uh, like uh, utensils, like uh, idols, uh, like that. We are collecting clay from uh, paddy field uh, or, or uh, river bed and uh, like uh, empty lakes. Uh, we mixed it in the blender, then filter by strain using the strain. Then we uh, make it soft by legs. Uh, we, we have a three wheels, first generation and second generation and third generation. We are using only second generation and third generation wheels. Second generation manual wheel and third generation wheel is a power wheel. Then uh, we are making some idols by hand only, of uh, clay modeling uh, or uh, murals, uh, sculpture, like that. Then uh, we keep all the products for dry 15 days in a shelter only, then 2 days sun dry, then uh, bake for 10 hours. Then it will change to natural color terracotta. Then we can apply the paint or uh, polishing, whatever we can do. Uh, in this, uh, utensils are also there. We can't do paint because that is a chemical. This is called uh, paddy field. Now you are seeing this paddy. We collect uh, from, uh, from uh, we collect uh, clay from this field only. See, uh, when uh, summer season only we collect it here. because uh, that time it, it will be dry completely. How much do you get from this land? How much of clay do you get? One load, one load, one time. Yes. How much? Yes. 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 I can't tell. With a truck or lorry. Oh, okay. For how long can that one load be? Used? For one year or two years. How much time is it takes to do this one? Yeah, yeah. Uh, I think four months will I think. Four months. After collecting from the planning field, 20 baskets of soil and equal amount of water are added into this blender. Then the motor is run for an hour and then the gate wall is open. Then the whole thing is collected into this strainer and it will be like muddy water. It will be less like that for, an, for a week and it will harden. The clay is then collected with the basket and then it's covered by a dropper rock which is then protected from sunlight and moisture and then it's later smashed using a feet so that it's soft enough so that we can use it easily. There are basically three kinds of water steels uh, that is first one, first generation, second generation and third generation water wheels. In the first generation water wheels uh, there are no ball bearings. Uh, we need two people for that and uh, it is not used anymore. Uh, the second generation wheel, uh, it has ball bearings. It requires only one person, that is uh, one person. He can just rotate the wheel, wheel using the stick and then he can make around three pots. The um, third generation wheel requires power source. It uh, runs by a speed controller. Apart from making forms, plates and was by the hand, they also make sculptures, idols and uh, even murals by the hand itself. After making the cave clay model by their hand, they keep it in shelter for drying for 15 days. The next step for drying is they expose it to sunlight and dry it in sunlight for 2 days and then they burn it. After that, the clay models are baked in the kiln for 10 hours and the temperature is up to 600 degrees Celsius. Uh, after baking, the color of the pot changes to terracotta color. Um, after that, the pots can even be painted or polished before using. 